Hi, I'm Will Brook. I'm the CEO of Brook Farm. I'm the second generation of our family business up here in Byron Bay. In terms of going global and Brook Farm and that program, I guess what it really did was just gave us the ability to be exposed to more imported distributors and more routes to market that we previously didn't have access to. Uh, and that's opened up export opportunities for us, uh, particularly in the UAE and South Korea. Yeah, some of the learnings that we got from the program were really about some of the, the data and opportunity within the countries that we were focusing on. So we had specific countries that, that Brook Farm really hadn't been in in any great significance, but to really gain some of the data and gain more insights into those markets and a few others as well was really key for us. Now growing from our you know, Australian beginnings to export to New Zealand, to China, to uh, South Korea, Japan, Indonesia, the Pacific Islands, and I guess the list goes on. So the start of Brook Farm was really all about that, that macadamia and, and creating products that really showcase the macadamia. And th that started with the, the toasted muesli, the natural muesli, the gluten-free muesli. I guess going further from there, one of the key concepts of Brook Farm is we have to make delicious food first. That is our number one thing for the products that we make. So no matter if it's gluten-free, it's keto, paleo, whatever it might be, it has to taste great first. The next five years for Brook Farm uh, will hopefully be extremely exciting. As we see the other side of COVID and those types of things, we've got potential markets that are essentially untapped that we have the opportunity to grow in. But otherwise, the export growth is, is so significant for us and we can really see ourselves as a, a global business and a global brand in the next five years. Mm -hmm.